Hey, what's up guys? I'm Tiger with Tiger Prime Media back with another Dokkan battle video and today I want to introduce you guys to the new Dokkan summoning simulator created by Reddit user Justin Scott aka JScott2K. Now, this simulator is still in its early stages but according to Justin, he does plan to keep it updated with new features as well as potential UI improvements in the future. But based on what I've experienced so far and just some testing that I've done, everything is working perfectly. And in this video, I just want to quickly talk about exactly how everything works so that you guys can go out and play around with it for yourselves. Of course, I'll leave a link to the website in my description down below. So definitely go check it out after you're done watching this video. But with all that said, let's jump right into it. And honestly, it's very, very simple to use. So when you first get to the website, there's going to be two options on top, global or Japan. Just click on the one that you want to summon on. So we're on global right now. And then the next option is for the type of banner you're summoning on. The first is standard, which basically only applies to, you know, ticket banners or a few random banners out there where there's no guaranteed SSR. There's also GSSR, which of course is guaranteed SSR, which is for most banners where you're spending stones. And then there's also featured guaranteed SSR, which for the most part applies to category banners and maybe something else that I'm forgetting right now. But for the most part, we're gonna be selecting GSSR here. And finally, we get to choose the banner we wanna summon on. So let's say you feel like doing some Intiket Goku summons. Just click on the banner and there you go. Or perhaps you're in the mood for some Peppy Gals. Just go over to the Girl Power banner and have at it, <laughs> whatever floats your boat. But for the purpose of today's video, we're actually gonna go back to the Tech LR Broly banner, mainly because I spent over a thousand stones on my main global trying to pull this guy, didn't get him, and I just wanna see how hard or easy it's gonna be to pull him on the simulator here and uh, potentially make myself a little bit salty. <laughs> we'll see what happens. But anyways, uh, once you have all this set up, just go down here to do a single summon or a multi summon. Let's start off with a single. And we're starting with an SR Krillin. And as you can see, there's some summon stats at the bottom here as well. So, so far we've pulled one card, used five stones, and our SR rate is 100%. And of course, that's all gonna change once we do some more summons. So, let's do a multi now. And there we go. We got one SSR as the guaranteed. And now we've pulled 11 cards used 55 stones, our SSR rate is 9%, SR rate is 63%, and our rate is 27%. So this is going to keep adding up unless you want to reset it. So let's click reset, and it all goes back to zero. And that's pretty much all there is to it, guys. Like I said, it's super, super simple. Just choose the version, choose the type of banner, and then choose the banner you actually want to summon on, and you're off to the races. So hope you guys enjoyed today's tutorial. But before we go, like I said, I do want to try to pull this Broly. So let's see what happens. All right, first multi and <sighs> really, really first multi LR cell. Of course, of course, of course. Okay, okay, okay. But no LR Broly yet. So I'm not like super salty. I'm just like, why couldn't this be on my actual account, right? Okay, fair warning, by the way, before you actually use the simulator, there is a very high chance you will be salty because I feel like more often than not, your summons on a simulator are gonna be better than your main like actual Dokkan account summons. So uh, just be prepared for that, all right? Just be prepared for that. All right, so that's the first multi. You already pulled one LR. Second multi. Um, okay, no LR there, perfect. Third multi, we got Shugesh. Fourth multi, fifth multi. Okay, this is more like it. This is more like it. Alright, so just a bunch of like, you know, not super exciting, unfeatured SSRs. Pretty standard for these kind of banners. Although all Bula's awesome. Alright. Um, Bergamo. 500 stones so far, guys. 500 stones. Um, still no LR Broly. Still no LR Broly. Still no LR Broly. There we go. Okay, there we go. So we spent 700 stones. Alright, 700 stones, 140 cards. 19% SSR rate, 51% SR rate, 29% R rate, and uh, we did manage to get the SSR or LR Tech LR Broly. Um, I think Justin did mention that he plans to actually include a section for LRs as well, just so people can keep track of that. But um, 
yeah, I mean, that's all there is to the simulator for now. You guys can do Japan as well for the JP banners if you want to do some simulation for, uh, you know, the full power LR uh, Frieza or whatever it is. And the cool thing about these simulators is that you can also go to like past banners too, right? So um, you can do like banners that are long gone now that will probably be, never be back in at least that iteration. You can go back to it using summons there just for fun. And that's really the purpose of these simulators, right? It's because it's not going to be a perfect representation of your actual summons in game, but if you're one of those people like me who have that summoning itch all the time and just want to do some summons without spending a ton of money or a ton of stones, then this is perfect for you. So like I said, link in the description, go check it out. And as far as I can remember, it's been a really long time since we've had a Dokkan summoning simulator that updates automatically, which this one apparently does. So we should be good to go for future banners as well, which is freaking fantastic. So thank you once again to Justin for making the simulator. And one last thing I would suggest to you guys is that if you have some extra money lying around or you're feeling extra generous today, consider donating a little bit to Justin at the bottom here not only to thank him for all the hard work he's put in, but also to offset some of the costs of hosting the website. Just think about it. But anyways, that's all I gotta say today, and uh, that's gonna do it for the video. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys are using the simulator and uh, what you think about it. And as always, if you guys enjoyed today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button. Join the Tiger Squad now, and while you're at it, hit that notification bell too so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all of my latest content. But that's all I gotta say guys, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate every single one of you. I will see you in the next video. Have a fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Up Comedia, signing out.